Here is News Channel 2 Sports Director Spencer Davidson. Good evening. The Colgate men's basketball program has become the cream of the crop in the Patriot League the last few years. Tonight they look to continue that and the Raider as the Raiders hosted the Patriot League final for the fourth straight year and look to earn the program's third title in the last five years. Top seeded Colgate squared off with two seed Navy with the winner earning the conference title and trip to March Madness. In the first from a whiteout, Cotterell. Raiders start strong. Nelly Cummings knocks down the mid-range J to open the scoring. Nearly midway through the half, Cummings facilitating cross court to Oliver Lynch Daniels who drives and then puts in the reverse. The senior scored 10, four point Raiders lead. Late stages of the half, Jack Ferguson up top. Beautiful look to Ryan Moffitt on the baseline cut. Moffitt finishes, Raiders were rolling. They led 40 to 22 at the break. Now Navy made it interesting in the second half, pulling to within just six. But coach Matt Langle went with the big guy and Jeff Woodward comes through. Here he finds Cummings for the nice double clutch layup. That just about ended any further threat as the Raiders hang on to win 74 to 58 to repeat as Patriot League champions. I thought we played great. I mean, there was just our defense was locked in. We made it hard on the Naval Academy. They got some some rebounds. Otherwise, it would have been a bigger lead early. Um, and then they threw the kitchen sink at us. We talk about all the time, nothing worthwhile in life ever comes real easy. And so it was kind of fitting that there was you know, we gave up a little bit of the lead and, and Navy fought tooth and nail to get back in the game. And then these guys kind of got back together and, and made the plays. I thought on defense uh, more than anything to, to, to secure the win. So super proud um, and, and excited for, for the next step. This is the fifth overall Patriot League title for the Raiders program. They've now won the program record 15 straight games and will learn their fate for the NCAA tournament on Selection Sunday.